was the key to your effectiveness tonight? Uh, <clears throat> I think just moving the ball in and out uh, on the fastballs, trying to uh, not get not get kind of handcuffed, uh, going to one single spot, and then uh, got some <clears throat> got some very timely ground balls, and um, you know avoided some trouble. Had a couple leadoff walks to innings, um, which a lot of times those are the ones that are going to kill you. So um, just just avoided trouble. <clears throat> you had expressed your frustration after your last start. Just how satisfying is it for you to go seven strong? I just want to help the team win. I mean, gen genuinely, um, you know, we're going for a sweep there against a team that's, uh, you know, been in front of us. And um, obviously, you know, we've had some some longer days, um, longer games with, with our bullpen, uh, needing, needing to catch a breather. But... Um, you know, just, just trying to do what I can. Go next to Brendan Cuddy. Andrew, how are you feeling going into the seventh inning and just considering your pinch count, were you surprised to be going out for the seventh inning? I, <clears throat> I don't exactly know how many pitches I was at. Uh, when I came in after the sixth, Booney asked me how I was feeling, said I'm feeling good. Uh, looked up there and saw that... Um, um, saw that Verdugo was leading off, um, obviously left on left matchup, thought that potentially that might have been my only hitter, um, but uh, just I think it was a batter by batter situation, and um, you know I, I'm feeling good and was was in a pretty you know pretty decent rhythm, and so I wanted to you know give us give us as many innings and many many outs as possible. Describe that feeling walking off the field uh, at the end of the seventh. It looked like you were getting a standing O and high five every palm in the dugout? Uh, I mean, honestly, a lot of times when I'm walking off the field, I'm pretty focused on, you know, just looking in the dugout, getting down the stairs, high five my teammates. Um, a lot of the other stuff is just kind of kind of shuts out a little bit. Um, but, you know, it's hard hard to miss it when, you know, I don't know how many people were here, but it seemed like everybody was cheering. And there was, there was more of a feeling than like a sound, I guess. But, um <clears throat> it's a really good feeling. Like I said, I, I, you know, I did my job tonight to give us a chance to win. And um, with this with this lineup that we have and this team, um, you know, that's you just you just got to give those guys a chance because they're going to put up runs. Go next to Tom Merriam. Andrew, what's the feeling around the team now that you've caught the Red Sox? <sighs> I mean, I. Th I think right now, I think guys are just extremely focused. Um, I, it, I, I don't think that anybody's talking specifically about the Red Sox. I think it's more focus on the Yankees, right? I mean, I think it's what we can do as individuals and as a team to, to go out there and win games regardless of who the opponent is. Um, obviously, it's great to sweep the Red Sox in a three-game series, um, but we want to we want to win no matter uh, no matter who we're facing